here's the question. Can a Democratic candidate for Senate get elected in Texas? And the answer is no. But there's always an exception to the rule. If the Republican incumbent is Ted Cruz, maybe. And if and the U.S. president is Donald Trump. And maybe. And so it's a close race. Beto O'Rourke is no doubt trying to capitalize on this moment and the division that has been sown largely by Donald Trump. He is running on a platform that is the antithesis of everything that Donald Trump is for. We are either going to be a nation of walls and Muslim bans and trying to make us afraid of one another, or we are going to be this big, courageous, strong, bold, ambitious people who put our differences behind us. And that, to me, is the Texas way. Very, very specifically, you're you're asking Texans to fire Ted Cruz after after one term. What's your argument for those Republicans in this tribal era who have not pulled down a Democratic lever in a quarter century? Why you? I don't see a partisan dynamic to any of the big issues here. It's just where Texas is right now. I can go to the reddest, most Republican county in the state, and people want great public schools. They want the dignity and function and purpose of work. Ted Cruz is a, a good human being. We just have very different ways of, of seeing things, and I think the people of Texas are owed a, a debate and a discussion and a contrast in vision, in service, in the way that we campaign, and, and they're getting it right now uh, in this Senate race. You are running as a Democrat. There has been talk among Democrats that they should pursue impeachment proceedings if they win back the House and Senate. Where yeah. do you stand on that? Um, I think that this is a legitimate topic for us to be talking about. I have seen too much to, to think that this president is fit to serve this country in that office. Would you vote to impeach him right now? I would. Yeah. And as a, as a senator, have you made your mind up about his removal from no. office? No. And what I was going to say, as a senator, we are each to vote based on the facts. Uh, based on the best interests of this country. And, and until I'm in that position and I'm able to hear the case made by each side, all the facts laid out, um, I can't give you an answer on that. And nor would you want me to.